okay for Frig Stack, so I'm gonna make a quick video showing you how I get a tire back on a tube since I got one already off of it. Or not on a tube, on a rim. With just a screwdriver and a piece of string. And this is how my my, uh, my great grandfather taught me how to do this. And uh, if I can get you to stand up here, I'll show you. Take tire, piece of string, tie the string, take your screwdriver, and I would suggest taking this tire and putting it where you can actually get to it. Take it, tie your string really good, take your screwdriver, go around here, and just tighten it down gradually until you get it so tight that you can't even move it no more. Then, hold on a second, it's giving me troubles. Or, this ought to be tight enough right here if you can see how that's bowed in like that. Just get it to where your, your, uh, your bead's touching your rim. Take your pump, it works better with an air compressor. Take it, and if it's not popping back on the bead, tighten your string a little bit more. Then, this is a lot easier with two hands, so I'd recommend getting a buddy to help you. If it's still not doing it, get it tighter. Try not to break the string like I just did. Which, I don't know, that should be tight. No. Well, if you can, tie your string again if you break it. I'd recommend getting a thicker string. Which, now this back end's off. I forgot it was the back end that came off anyway. But. I've done it with a string like this before. So it, it's not remember where I left off because this fucking iPod keeps shutting down. Uh, tie your string again. And make sure you get it on there tight. Or else your rim's not, your bead's not gonna pop back on. And if this iPod shuts down one more fucking time, I'm launching it. Depending on where your bead's broken at, move your string towards where it's broken. So, since my bead's broken on this side, I'm going to move the string towards that side a little bit. So, then tighten down. You might want to move it a little more. I mean, you could do this with anything. You could probably do this with steel cable.